This is a Calculus 3 problem regarding partial derivative of this unusual function here. And then some mathematics there to calculate a, the derivative at a certain point. So our function is x natural log of quantity y cosine x. And then we're supposed to input the ordered pair pi over 3 comma 1 once we're done with the derivative. So let's start with the partial of f with respect to x. So the partial of f with respect to x of my function, well, there's an x here multiplied by the natural log, and there's an x inside the natural log. So that means I have to use the product rule in order to do this derivative. So I'm going to take the derivative of the first function times the second function. plus the first function times the derivative of the second function. Now the derivative of the any natural log of a function is the derivative of the inside portion of the natural log divided by the original inside. So if I take the derivative of y cosine x with respect to x, y is a constant so it stays, but the derivative of cosine is minus sine. So that's my numerator and then the denominator is the original y cosine x. So if I simplify a little, I get natural log of y cosine x. Um, minus, well, the y's will cancel. Sine over cosine is tangent, so x tangent x. Okay, so now the next part of my job is to take this derivative and insert into it the ordered pair pi over 3 comma 1. So I put a 1 in for y and a pi over 3 in for cosine. I'm sorry, pi over 3 in for x. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was just thinking about something, sorry. All right, so here we go. This is going to be the natural log of 1 times, well, cosine of pi over 3. If I think about that, pi over 3 is somewhere up here. So cosine is going to be 1 half minus pi over 3. Well, tangent is sine over cosine. So at this point, sine is going to be square root of 3 over 2 and cosine is 1 half. So I'm just going to simplify those numbers a little bit and I should be done. So the natural log of 1 half minus pi over 3. And then here I can get rid of the 2's. I'm left with square root of 3. So natural log of 1 half minus pi square root of 3 over 3. Now when I approximate that with my calculator, let me get let my little machine out. All right, let's see. There's my machine. All right, so I want to do the natural log of 1 divided by 2 minus pi times the square root of 3 divided by 3. I get negative 2.5069. Negative 2.5069. So this is the exact value here because I didn't use my calculator yet and this is the approximate value here. 